All right, next we're gonna talk about the best way to slice your meat for jerky. If we take one of these steaks, we notice that there's gonna be a length and a short end. Each way we cut it is gonna have a different texture for our jerky. If we want longer, more stringier type jerky, we're gonna cut lengthwise. If we want tighter, firmer, smaller pieces of jerky, we're gonna cut width. So both ways are fine. Both ways are just gonna produce a different texture on your jerky. There's no right or wrong way to do it. Each one is gonna produce the same flavor, just textures are gonna be different. And I'll show you those textures. One, we've got all the bands running one way, going up and down, so as that meat cooks, it's gonna shrink into itself. And then we have the one where the pockets are all over because we're cutting against the grain. And when that happens, the meat's gonna actually kind of expand a little bit as it cooks. Not expand where it's gonna get bigger, but the, the, the veins of the meat itself are gonna start to separate a little bit. So those are the two ways that you can slice your venison for jerky, length or width.